welcome friends uh, welcome to civil learning point in this video you will learn about uh, the duties of civil site engineer on the construction site construction site okay so when you work to the construction uh, site at that you should know what is your actual duty you are going to perform okay so uh, before that you know if you haven't uh, subscribe my channel please Sus here the subscribe button please subscribe here and if you want to watch my videos go and watch okay so whatever be the information i'm going to upload you will get the notification so start the today's topic so what are the uh, duties you are going to uh, you have to know so that you will perform your work easily so this is the uh, duties of all the fresher site engineers and uh, especially the for fresher because they don't know what i am going to perform and what what is the requirement of the fresher uh, site engineers so the guys first duty is inform the worker about the safety so you are the site engineer you should know all all the every all everything about the safety purpose so the first thing you have to know the importance of safety to all the employees who are working on the site and give uh, in the site uh, there is a safety officer also available so you have to guide them also okay in the as we know that the, in the uh, summer season as the temperature is high and the, even the concrete having high temperature so it is very difficult to work so the for in that conditions uh, the safety is required for all uh, required to the workers okay so this thing you should know your duty is to perform all the workers whether the worker has a word on the safety purpose or not so you have to inform them because you know the all the workers are not educated so being a educated a uh, civil site engineer and the perfect civil site engineer you should uh, inform them to uh, about the safety so that uh, their uh, body will be protected from the heat and any other consequences okay so next thing is in case the manpower at the different locations under under the site engineers there are the super super uh, supervisor laborers helper okay so you have to uh, tell them uh, what is your job requ what is your uh, requirement on that project what is what you have to do and what is your current locations to work there to perform there okay that you have to uh, tell them okay second second duties of the site engineers next is quantity calculation okay guys so this is very important for site engineers so what you have to do the site engineer should have the knowledge about the calculation of quantity of bricks you know you uh, what you have to do, you will uh, see the plans according to the plans you have to told uh, you told that to the employees uh, what are the number of bricks required and what is the concrete is required what is the cement sand uh, aggregate will be required that you have to know according to the site plan according to the structural drawing you have to told them this amount thing is required it in according to that estimation will be also calculated okay number of quantity calculation so this thing also you should know okay guys so next thing you have to uh, the material informations so a uh, site engineer should note the information what the material is available and what the material are finished so um, you have to uh, you have to know the what is the material is required what material finished so know the information so that you can uh, you can uh, purchase you can order the, from the market or any other ways you can purchase so that you whenever your work is going to start uh, then there will be no problems that that material is not in the in the storage that problem should not be occur okay next thing is preparation of bar bending schedule so being a site engineer you should have knowledge about the bar bending schedule in upcoming videos i am going to uh, tell about how to prepare the uh, bar bending schedule this is totally practical knowledge and guys uh, i am going to upload all this in the quantity of uh, bricks concrete area of searching and in in this related videos i am going to upload so don't uh, for don't uh, don't forget to watch and uh, please subscribe so that you will get the upcoming videos. Let's proceed. 
So next is understand the drawing. Being a site engineer, you should know the uh, drawing concept so that you will perform your task. Okay. Sixth point is the seventh point. You you have to prepare the report, daily progress report, which includes the materials, fuel, manpower, what amount of materials is left, what amount of uh, manpower is uh, left uh, to the uh, from the construction site, what what they are doing. So all these things you have to report. At the end of the day, the daily progress report will be made, which includes the remaining work on the site and the next day of the work. So what amount of uh, work is left? That also you have to uh, that work up so you have to make the report so in this way you can calculate okay so many other things are to be performed for the site engineers